the technique which i'm going to share with you today for public speaking to overcome the anxiety and to give a really rocking presentation or your public talk i mean i have used this many times this has helped me and my hundreds and thousands of my students to be a better communicator on the stage this technique is called as image substitution a powerful technique which is based on scientific study and research just stay with me use this technique and see what is the impact of this technique on your public speaking skills let's start well i'll tell you my story uh, i remember i was doing my phd and it was the year 2015 my second presentation was there in the phd presentation i was very nervous i mean one day before i was very nervous i imagined that my guides and my judges will be there they will ask me difficult questions i won't be able to answer those questions i will fumble and i will just read my notes and all my presentations will be a flop one day before one night before in fact i couldn't sleep properly i woke up at 4 o'clock started preparation was very nervous and really i i mean i was scared to death okay it was 10 o'clock in the morning i went in the presentation hall i went on the stage and what i was i had imagined actually the same thing happened all the judges were sitting there my guide was there and all the students from mtech they were all present there and i started reading actually my plan was not to read but i started reading i didn't have eye contact i i, I just mumbled i i just fumbled i couldn't uh, make eye contact with all the judges with my guide as well and i finished my presentation and i asked do you have any questions i was low in confidence and of course all the judges who were there they grilled me they found out lot of faults in my presentation in my experiments in my study in my research whatever theoretical research i have done and it was complete flop i came to my home and i was really depressed disturbed very 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 sad and i was a trainer at that time also i couldn't understand why i failed myself then i analyzed then i realized that my mistake my mistake was i was already imagining that i failed in the presentation one night before i was nervous i had already imagined that my presentation will be flop huh everyone will laugh at my presentation my guides my judge will grill me there and this actually was going on in my head with this imagination i went on the stage and due to that i wasn't confident because i imagined whatever what will be wrong and what what will happen if that thing go wrong huh? that thing will not work this was all in my head and with this imagination i went on the stage and i was experiencing the same thing because my body language my pitch of voice my eye contact everything was according to what i imagined and the audience realized that my judges my guide realized that and they grilled me well the second presentation was after 4 months and this time i did not do any mistake i prepared of course i prepared thoroughly one day before i was calm quiet and composed and i visualized that i imagined that i was giving a nice presentation my judges were very happy with my presentation the students the mtx students were really happy they were impressed they were listening to me all this i imagined in my head took a nice sleep went on the stage close to the podium started my presentation but there was a big change now i was very confident good eye contact with everyone and i spoke continuously for 30 minutes without stopping every slide was properly explained and i i was realizing that those judges and those students were listening me intently they were focused they were riveted they were not fiddling with their phones they were laser like focused they were just listening to me and after my talk was over i asked any question this time there was only one question and it was just a simple question which i answered but i could i could recognize that my my guide the judges and all the students were quite impressed and this happened 
because I replaced my images in my head. Initially, I was imagining that huh? everything will go wrong. I won't be able to deliver properly. I will forget, and all the presentation will go wrong. But here, this time, I imagine in a better way. I imagine that things will go right. I will give a rocking presentation. I am on the stage. The audience is listening to me, and actually, this image became a self-fulfilling prophecy. And actually, when I went on the stage, I delivered that. You can also do that. This is called as image huh? substitution, a really powerful technique which will help you to be a good public speaker. It's all in your head. Next time, whenever you are going for a presentation or a public talk, hold on. and imagine everything going properly you are going on the stage you are holding the mic looking at the audience you greet the audience start your talk you just slowly get into the groove crack some good jokes audience laughs you are moving on the stage and there are clappings and laughters they laugh at your jokes and you end the talk you get a standing ovation this will help you to go with a positive mindset on the stage this does not mean that without preparation just imagine and everything will fall in place i'm not saying that what i'm saying is preparation plus proper imagination will give you better results all right friends next time try this and see it really works pleasure talking to you and my best wishes for your next public talk or presentation bye bye thank you